Deerking, vandals leave their mark all over property in Claremont County. Spray paint was their weapon of massive destruction. Local 12's Larry Davis joins us live. He's in Claremont County where property owners are cleaning up the mess, Larry. Hi, Rob. Well, this is Claremont Lane in Union Township in Claremont County, and this is just some of the graffiti that's been left behind by those vandals who struck just late last week. Uh, the destruction of property here and the lack of respect as neighbors red hot. Rachel Kaler woke up the other morning to find graffiti had been spray painted on her party bus. She has since removed it. I noticed that they had painted the entire hood of my car, inappropriate diagrams, and down the side of this part of my bus with other diagrams. Rachel notified neighbors on Claremont Drive and Glen Esty Lane. The vandals had left their mark, vandalizing a World War II veterans workshop. The interior of this RV had been spray painted and had Oreo cookies crushed everywhere. A child's pool was slashed, car interior spray painted, and this solar light pole was jammed through a mailbox. The vandals struck Bill Walker in Crystal Bowles' home. Crystal's car was spray painted. I was mad. I was really mad. Uh, I have a really nice custom paint job on my car, and seeing spray paint all over it kind of really ticks you off. The roommate's car was also targeted. Neighbors think the vandals were juveniles. From the words we saw and the things uh, that they did damage, I would say definitely kids, definitely teenagers, uh, pretty immature. If we find these kids, Either they, the kids don't want us to find them. Mm -hmm. Trust me, it wouldn't be a good day for them. People who live here say this is very uncharacteristic of this quiet neighborhood. This doesn't happen on our street. We are, we are good, close street. We talk and wave each other. We, um, we just have a good relationship. We can leave our garage open. If you're coming in the backyard, you don't have to worry about it. And now we all feel like you can't leave nothing open. And Rob, of all the vandalism that happened on this street and the adjoining street here, uh, the one that really has neighbors seething is what was done to that veterans uh, workshop just down the street. Uh, they not only went in, spray painted, ransacked the place, but he had a $1 bill that was framed from the first buck that he made in his business. They broke that frame and they stole the $1 bill. Live in Union Township, Larry Davis, Local 12 News. Rob, back to you. That's just sad and the whole thing just seems childish, doesn't it, Larry? It most certainly does. It most certainly is. And uh, they, they, they think that these were probably uh, young teenagers who just didn't have anything else better to do on a Thursday morning, uh, Thursday overnight, Friday morning. But mess with somebody else's life. Larry, thanks very much. Union Township Police say they are still looking for leads in this case, but so far no arrests have been made. So if you can help police, please call Crime Stoppers 352-3040 is the number and you do not have to give your name.